washing pots at four o'clock in the morning, like, all right then. Welcome back to my channel. I'm pretty much getting ready for work right now. Let us just let us just start by saying, wow, I love my hair in this camera. But um, I did not sleep good this morning. I kept waking up ever so often. I feel like I went to bed like after 11, and I woke up I think two o'clock, and then I went back to sleep and I woke up four o'clock again. And when I woke up four o'clock, that was pretty much it because it was just mad loud up in here. My husband was in the kitchen washing pots at four o'clock in the morning, like, all right then. Anyways, um, I'm pretty much ready for work. And honestly, I had to make a real strong cup of coffee because the way how I'm feeling right now, only coffee can save me. Today, I, I really just have not been banking on these clinicals that my job has been calling me for, like, my guy, I'm gonna need y'all to just sign me up to go in and just do a regular shift, which is what I was signed up for. And the um, the lady in the employment office called me yesterday, and she was just like, "You want to just come at 8:30 tomorrow for a clinical, and then you have the option of like staying after you're done or going on the third floor to work." And I'm like, "Okay, sure." So I'm going in for 8:30. I think I want to get there. I was trying to see if I could get there like a little bit early just in case maybe like 7 30 just in case i was also thinking i might take an uber if it's not too much money i feel like the day the day before my day off i be feeling like my body knows and so my body wants to crash my battery just died so i'm saying the day before my day off it's like my body knows and so it starts crashing on me where it concerns work and then the days after my day off i just be feeling like i have to drag myself to like get there but it is a combination of the fact that I'm well rested and just the fact that you know that you're just coming off of your day off. But like after that first day after my day off, like I'm good to go again and like I'm ready. Next week is going to be a rough week for me because today is Friday and I'm working Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. My next day off is Saturday. So I'm going to be working eight days straight without a break, which is pretty much fine. Because when I leave here in the evenings, I get to like sleep for an hour or like an hour and a half and I'm good to go the next day. So that is pretty much dope. But um, yeah, I've, I had some coffee just now and I think I'm going to have some porridge. I still have so much time left before 8.30 because I set my alarm to wake me up at like 6 o'clock. And like I said, I was up from way before 6 o'clock. 5 about 5.50 is when I really started moving around and like putting this wig on and stuff because last night I wasn't sure which one of the wigs I wanted to wear. So far it looks like every Wednesday I changed my wig. So I'll wear this one for like a week and then by Wednesday I get tired of seeing it and I want to wear the next one. Truth is all I need to do is wash it. The other day why I ended up taking it off is because I was at work and it looked a little dry and so I put some in. <laughs> I put some, there's this oil that we have, it's like Vaseline. Let me see if I can find one to show you guys. I'm pretty sure I have. I always have. Oh. This white petroleum. This shit says skin protectant, which means that, you know, it's thick enough to protect your skin, but not to put in the wig. And that is what I did. As we we're talking about skin protectant, because it's cold and it's like a snowy day and stuff. I think I'm gonna open one of them and like rub some on like my legs and stuff like that because this is really OD for dry skin like if your skin is ever feeling dry just get some of this and you're gonna be good so yeah because of that it was looking a little clammy and stuff and I hate that clammy look and so I ended up taking it off and putting on a different one just to give myself a different look too to be honest but when I put the, the other one on the long one I didn't even end up doing anything to this one in terms of like 
washing it or whatever. And what happens is I have wigs that I can go in between because I don't want to pressure one too much. I think I might end up making another one that's similar to this again. But honestly, loving this bob, especially with the jackets and everything. I have two jackets laid out to wear today and I'm hoping they keep me warm enough the other day. One of my coworkers was saying, Wow, oh, Jadine, you really love the smaller jackets. I just feel like if it's too big, it just feels too big, you know? I also feel like I need to buy a backpack as opposed to like the pocketbook that I currently have. Because like in the winter time right now, it's falling off of my shoulder, it's doing the most. So at least if I have like a backpack, then I'm able to put it on via the two straps and then that just be it. But um, let me just lotion since I'm already doing this. But yeah, so today I'm supposed to be taking a resident to a doctor's appointment. I'm really hoping that actually happens. And like by the time I'm done is like one o'clock or so. So I won't have a long left at work because the worst thing would be to take a resident to an appointment and come back and do a full assignment, which anywhere after like 10, 11 o'clock, you should be well on your way with most of your residents. So, so much work should not be there if I leave at 8.30. But um, yeah, it's also, oh, I've been kind of annoyed since yesterday because it was snowing yesterday and the day before, which means that there is residual snow, which at this point is just mountains of ice on the sidewalks. And I'm thinking if I'm taking a resident to their appointment, chances are we're gonna come up on a, how am I gonna pull this wheelchair in or like push the wheelchair in the snow? But then I looked outside and I saw that the neighbors had cleared their driveway. So I'm like, wow, Janine, seriously, you really thought that an office would not have like cleared their walkway so you'd be able to push a wheelchair and I'm like wow I guess I'm just having one of those moments you know anyways I'm making some oatmeal to have for breakfast and then um I should be good to leave so that is well underway I feel like I need to get some new scrubs why is this one so white I'll show her the other one this shit was probably not washed properly oh laundromats this is why I start washing them myself at home because I feel like they're not done properly. Anyways, I'm going to check on the thing. Change this top because look at the arm. Nothing is barely showing on camera. And I don't know if I want to wear it like that. It's bothering me a little bit, so I don't think I will. Anyways, I'm going to go get myself together. Hi, guys. <laughs> Hi, guys. I'm at work. Just been sitting down for... Maybe like the last 30 minutes because I feel like I'm so tired and you rarely ever get these opportunities where it's not you break, but you can just sit just to sit. So I'm taking advantage of it. I feel like when I go home today, I'm going to take this wig off and give it like some little curls and stuff because for the most part, this is how I've been wearing it. So I'm going to take it off, give it some curls and try to put some holding spray on there to see how it like holds up. But for the most part, I really do love it like this, just doing its thing or whatever. I've had it on for two days at this point. Um, I wore it yesterday. I didn't take it off last night and I'm wearing it today. Normally I like to like take it off and give my scalp a little break and stuff and then put it back on. So I want to take it off today and give it some curls and see how I like that and if that could hold it for another two days or and stuff. Because lately I've been trying to keep it on for at least two days, then take it off, give myself a break and reinstall it to like wash this part and whatever. But I've also been feeling like maybe I should take my hair out. Anyways, I leave in about 30 minutes. So if I can sit down for the next 30 minutes, then that's amazing. But if not, then that's fine because I did get 30 minutes to sit down. I'm wearing my little boots today. Okay, let me see if I can show you guys without showing you guys everything. Boots. So love that for me because, you know, with the snow and everything, like the boots really comes in clutch can't wait to go home i think i'm gonna sleep today even though i don't really feel tired i feel like it's when i go home that it really is gonna catch up to me but for the most part i'm just here chilling however i feel like the clips that you guys watch prior to this they have no ending so popping in to end that vlog thank you guys for watching i hope you guys enjoyed happy holidays and i'll see you guys in the next video